right, you guys, I am finished getting ready now. Welcome back, or welcome if you're new here. It is Friday, May 29th. We are seven days away from induction day, so we got a week left, or less. Depends on if she decides to come on her own. So we're gonna get Lennon's day seven present real quick. We're trying to start heading out here soon, but she needs to open her present, and then I have to get her ready. Sit down. Sit down. Go sit down and open it. What are you doing? Go sit over here. Sit down. Open it. It's a very nice bowling outfit you got. Yeah. I'm sure nothing will want to pop out. You don't have to cover up. Just sit down. <laughs> All right. Open it. I don't know. What is it? Stickers? Stickers? Oh, what are those? Dada. Dogs? Mau Mau? Mau Mau. How about these? What are those? It's 15, 12. <laughs> Me. Me. They're kind of like horses. Time is it? Me. Uh, I don't know. Me. Three forty. Those are unicorns. Two. Unicorn. Two. Yeah. Yeah, we got a new microwave and it's freaking massive compared to our other one and takes up so much space. And I and it hate it. It doesn't have number things on it. You turn the numbers like I mean, it's fancy and it's nice and we really needed one because our old microwave was about to give out. But I really hate how like much space it takes up on the counter because I already don't have enough counter space. And I had to rearrange the kitchen again. We also got a new pot and pan set because ours sucked. They were impossible to clean. Everything stuck to it. Half of them were so like completely metal so you would burn the crap out of yourself if you grabbed it without an oven mint. And yeah, we just needed a whole new set, so we bought a new set of pots and pans as well. Which we haven't even got to use yet. We got them. Today is, it's, well, we got them yesterday, but this will make two days that we haven't used them yet. Because we're not going to be cooking tonight. And we didn't end up cooking yesterday because we had a really late lunch and weren't hungry enough for dinner. So we just snacked for dinner. So we haven't cooked Where are or they? used them. Toenail on there. I don't know. I don't ever use them. I don't. I literally never clip my fingernails. I only do hers and she has her own. Anyways, um, he kind of made a comment already, but. Today we are going to be having like a little family date, our last family day oh, date as a family of three. I mean obviously it's not the last day of being three because she might not be here until a week from today. But this is our last chance to go out and do something, just us three before we're stuck at home with a newborn. And honestly I wanted us to be doing stuff this whole time together. but. Corona ruined that and we've been stuck at home, but things are finally starting to open and we're gonna take advantage of it and do one last little thing together. So we're gonna be going bowling, hopefully. They're not too packed, I don't know. I called them and was like, hey, yeah, I was checking on your availability, how's it been? And he's like, yep, very busy, no reservations, first come, first serve. I was like, well, that's a lot of help, dude, thanks. <laughs> so. We're gonna go there. I'm dying for some nachos and cheese. I have been wanting them for so long and haven't had them in forever. So if they've uh -huh. got that, I'm going to be ecstatic. Taco Bell. They're not the same. I need me the round, the big round ones, and the hot, melty cheese. Taco Bell's just doesn't, it's not the same. I need like my, like, fair nachos, you know, like, no, you just want to reminisce on skating, skating rink nachos. It's 
stuff like that, you know, ones you get places like that. I haven't had them. I haven't had nachos like that in at least a year. And even before that, it's been scarce. I had them at the races at one time. And I had like two bites of some at Skateland that one time when we went in South Carolina. So I'm dying for some nachos and cheese. So that's like, he keeps yelling at me every time I say this, but I've been saying that I hope that they have them. But he's all like, it's a bowling alley. They're gonna have them, but you never know. So we're gonna do that. And then we're gonna do, go have a dinner. I did not vlog yesterday. I filmed a sit down video, so I didn't get to show you guys her opening a present, but I did film it. So I'm gonna include that in this video. So this was her opening her advent thing from hey. yesterday. Get your number eight. Get your number eight. Did I help you? What number? Number eight. Get your number eight. You should like this one. It's a butterfly bag. Just sit down. No, just go sit down first because you'll see it. <laughs> I put it out of the way so that doesn't happen. Sit down. Look, sit down. You forgot about it. Daddy. We're in love with it at the store and then you forgot. What is that? Daddy. What is that? That's hi. <gasps> is that your owl? Aww. That's what she did the whole time at the store was just hug it and didn't let go. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is that an owl? Owie. You want to open owie, it? Owie, owl. Owie. Let's Let open it. Let me open it so you can get it out. Mm. What is that? Is it an owl? Mm. Give it a huggy. Huggy. Yeah. Move this blanket. Look, ready? Look. Whoa. Look. Here's your owl, but now it's a blankie. Look at that. It's an owl blankie. She's looking at it like, what happened to him? Yeah, like, oh my god! <laughs> oh, that's off. Is that gonna be your blankie? You like it? What is with you and them? Mm. Mm. All right, London, which outfit? Okay. What you wanna wear? Black. What do you wanna wear? Black. Which one? You gotta get dressed. Pick one. You want you want this one or this one? I know, it's all over TikTok. You want that? You wanna wear the dress? Alright. Cleo's walking all over everything.
She seemed to enjoy it. She got, she was a little antsy when it wasn't her turn, but she did pretty good. Now we are heading to a dinner. Pretty fancy dinner. We've only had this place once and it was amazing, but it's like the most expensive dinner we've ever eaten together. But I really want some hibachi. That's what we've been planning to go out and eat for months, but quarantine kept not making it possible. So now we're finally gonna get some hibachi. <coughs> And After tip, a hundred dollars. Hopefully it's good. Uh, this is a different location, but the same branch. Sadly, the concessions were not open, kind of like I told him, so I did not get nachos. They were open. They were opening when we were leaving. They open at night. They opened the arcade. They were opening the grill. They were opening the, the bar. Open they were opening it. That's why they're wiping all the stuff down. Anyways, I did not get nachos, so maybe another time, another place, I don't know. I'm sure we'll be back eventually, but not anytime soon because we're about to have a newborn, so. <laughs> My leg was messed up that whole time, so it was actually pretty hard to try and bowl. So I'm gonna use that as an excuse of how a not even two-year-old beat me so bad. She beat me by 25 points. <laughs> she beat me by like 50 points at least. Look at the drink of the month. What are you doing? His drink is a quarantine. Say cheese. Bye. And... 
Hey, can I get a hot triple chocolate brownie? Also a Oreo cookie cheesecake blizzard. What size? Uh, medium. Um, yes, a hot fudge sundae, please. What size? Small. Uh, small, please. Okay. Uh, that's it. That'll be 11 to 17 at one day. Thank you. We're back home now. We got our Dairy Queen. Now we're about to go sit and eat real quick, and then me and London are going to take a bath. I have to do my bunk lip because it's Friday, and I do it every Friday. I'm 38 weeks today, so I got to do that. And I just found out that either things changed or we have our information wrong, but as grandma is actually not coming until Sunday, we thought she was gonna be here tomorrow afternoon, but instead she'll be here Sunday afternoon. So we just had to add a day in there. So hopefully that'll be fine. Uh-uh, no man, no crash. Uh -huh. Oh man, so. We're about to eat our ice cream. Christopher's out there trying to fix the fence again because the dogs have found new spots again. and. Nyx always gets in and out. She can actually get back in the fence on her own. And she's so small she can get out of like anything. And then Rhea started getting out again uh, like a week ago and she can't get back in except for through the front, which is really annoying. And then last night, Cleo, which she never gets out, Cleo learned how to get out and could not get back in. So she was stuck on the other side of our fence in our neighbor's yard barking at us because she couldn't get back in the fence. So we had to drive around and go pick her up. She did it again this morning and then it started to just downpour out of nowhere. So she was stuck on the other side of the fence barking her head off while it's pouring rain. I'm stuck on the couch feeding lunch to London. Christopher was in the shower. And then I guess she got so sick of being poured on that she managed to find her way back in finally and she came and sat in front of the door soaking wet and she looks so ashamed. So yeah, he's trying to fix some of the planks and see if he can keep them in the fence once again. I don't know how many times we have fixed this fence and it has not worked. Is that good? Did you have fun? Did you have fun today? You went bowling? Did you go eat? And now you got ice cream? Mmm. Mmm. I've been dying to have a molten lava cake and this is like the closest thing I can get. So, hopefully it's good. The best place to get the molten lava cakes from is Applebee's, but we never really go to Applebee's. Because their food is honestly not the best. I just like them because they have mozzarella sticks and molten lava cakes, but we rarely go. I can't even get it open. It's not super fresh because of, uh, we had to wait the car ride. We had to pick it up, by, it was right by the restaurant. And then we had to stop by the ATM because we needed to deposit some cash, but the ATM wasn't even working. So we didn't even get to deposit our cash. And then Christopher stopped by the gas station, so. Mm. It's been sitting a minute, but it's still pretty good. Mm. And London definitely likes hers. That's not a straw, that's a spoon. <laughs> oh, nice one. You're getting that blanket. Filthy dude, why'd you let her do that? <sighs> oh. <laughs> Can you hear it? What is that, your seam? Oh. I forgot I had it in there. <laughs> what, your butt plug? Yeah. Like I said, we are finishing up our ice cream. I'm finished. London's pretty much done. Christopher is eating his now. He's back in from fixing the fence, which we don't know if it even did anything or not. I'm about to go do my bump clip for my progression video, and then London and I are going to have a quick little bath because it's already 8.30, and I'm exhausted today. I'm ready to get this makeup off my face, 
and get this bra off. I would hate wearing a bra. I wear a bra maybe like once a week. And even that is too much. To go shopping. <laughs> what? I said to go shopping. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please leave a like and a comment below. Subscribe to the channel before you go if you have not already. He said. Thank you for watching today's video, and I will see you tomorrow. Yeah. Say bye. Bye.